Now, which condition is considered a STEMI imposter? Would it be A, right bundle branch block, B, left bundle branch block, C, hyperkalemia, or D, inferior wall MI? Now, we all know what a STEMI is, ST elevation, myocardial infarction. And remember, ST segment elevation is found with cardiac injury. Now, D, inferior wall MI, is an actual MI. It's not necessarily an imposter, so we can go ahead and rule that one out. We're left with A, B, and C. Now, for you to answer this, you need to know that there are five classic imposters of a STEMI. Number one, we'll have LVH, left ventricular hypertrophy. Number two, early repolarization. Three, pericarditis. Four, a paced rhythm. And number five, a left bundle branch block. Now I'm not saying any five of these patients are not having an MI. I always tell people, if it looks like a duck and it quacks like a duck, it's probably a duck. So if you come across somebody with that crushing chest pain that's not going away, and it had maybe this gradual onset, whatever the case might be, and they have one of these five, go ahead and transport them to your cath lab. And of course, follow your protocols, but know that there are STEMI imposters that are out there. Hope this helps. Answer here, B, left bundle branch block.